Hello everyone, and welcome back to my Pokemon Yellow Let's Play. We're going to continue the ascent of Pokemon Tower, <laughs> and hopefully this time we will get to the top. Who knows? Now we've got lots of Ghastlies to take out, probably a few Haunters, but hopefully it will go <laughs> through without too much problems. Okay, Nightshades shouldn't do too much. That did quite a bit, but we can take three or four of those, no problem. Confuse Ray and Lick are going to be our biggest problems here. Because Lick is, has the chance of para paralysis and Confuse Ray will make us confused. And if those two are combined, that's a big problem. Luckily, there's a healing pad up here, so we can be healed from the, the status ailments. And we can heal Babar from death in the previous episode. Send Steven out, because he seems to be the best against these guys with pecs. Yeah, we can take maybe four of those, so that shouldn't be much of a problem. See, that does almost full... That almost takes it out in one, so... We should be good if we... I should probably put Steven out in front. Yep, I'll try it. I'll do that now, before I forget. I wonder what items I have. Do I have healing items? I have a few super potions. I sh uh, one lemonade. This should be fine then. Steven should be able to cope with these guys much better. Lick doesn't affect me, which is great, because I'm part normal. But he just keeps <laughs> continually using Lick. Steven is definitely the best choice for this. More random encounters? This is where I'd really wish to speed them up, but I don't like it with the music. <laughs> I feel like it ruins everything. I can just run from some of these. I don't really need the experience. And another random encounter. Fantastic. Luckily, as long as they don't keep using a fuse ray, I should be totally fine. Yeah, because they, they keep using Lick for some reason. The AI is not the best. Let's heal. That's great. So now we have our fainted Pokemon is back to life. Zombies. <laughs> okay, that's abrupt. Chandler wants to fight. Sent out Ghastly. Okay, Ghastly again is no problem. As long as there's no Haunters. Haunters could be a bit of a problem. Oh, that's, that's, yeah, it does a lot of damage. <laughs> this should go, this should be okay. Yeah, absolutely no problem. <laughs> the critical hit was definitely overkill. Ha! <laughs> Got 720 Poké Dollars, nice. I really like the music in this place, although it's quite off-putting at some parts. What do you have to say? Give me your soul. Alright then. If you can beat me, you can have my soul. How about that? A Haunter. This is not what I wanted to see. Confuse Ray will be a big problem from the sky. Hopefully Peck is a two hit... <laughs> critical hit! That's very helpful. So I don't have to worry about this Haunter. Two critical hits! Steven is a big critical hit fan, apparently. Okay. Gasp. 690 Poké Dollars. Let's keep going. As I said, I'm going to try and possibly finish this in this video, as long as it doesn't go on too long. It's only been a few minutes, I think, so we might be able to pull it off. Steven is going to be doing most of the work, as I've said. That did a solid amount of damage. I'm level 30 now, but I don't see anyone else being as helpful c due to those licks. Okay. Key, 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 key. Alright then. Sent out Ghastly. Again, Ghastly's are no problem. Sorry if the audio's going a bit weird. I can hear it at some parts. <laughs> But it's fine most of, the, most of the time. Okay, Peck. Again. 
very helpful. Defeated the channeler. Key. <laughs> Alright then. Hmm. Earth qua. Channeler wants to fight. Send out Ghastly. Level 30, yep, as I thought. Should be <laughs> probably a 2 hit KO. Maybe even a 1 now. No, it's still a 2 hit KO. Confused. Peck. Nice. Don't get hurt in confusion. That's the last thing we need. Okay. Uh, some rare candy. Nice. We'll probably use them right at the end. There's no point in using them at this point. Ghastly. This should be a one hit KO. If I hit. <laughs> and... It is. Oh, that was a critical hit. <laughs> we need to see how much a peck does to a normal level 23. Right, now we've got to fight the Marowak, so... Should probably put Jakob in front. So we can get some experience and the type advantage. Be gone, intruders. So before if we got to this part, it would just be a ghost that we can't do any damage to. But now that we have the self scope, we can see that it was actually the mother of the Cubone in Lavender Town. The, the ghost of. <laughs> Let's do a Mega Drain. Uh, that's an easy two hit KO. As long as this doesn't get... Oh my god, that did a lot of damage. Okay. Mega Drain should get some life back and easily take it out. That was much easier than expected. Rest the soul of Cubone's mother. Oh, that's a nice story. Now we have look we have a battle between against Team Rocket, like in Mount Moon. Grandpa here wanted to complain, so we're setting him straight. So render yourself invisible or prepare to fight. So we're fighting Jesse and James once again. Rocket wants to fight. Sent out Meowth. We could probably keep in uh, this guy. Poison powder. First of all. That does a de oh he got the flinch. He's going to growl. Okay, the poison. Give me a second, guys. Uh, let me just... Okay, <laughs> that, that should stop. I was getting Skype notifications. Stop, that'll stop it coming up in the recording. I think I'm just spamming poison powder accidentally. <laughs> yep, okay. The audio is going nuts right now. Uh, I think it's I think it's gonna stabilize now. Okay, yeah, Skype was Skype was trolling there. Okay, Arbok. That is not a good type matchup. Let's see. Uh, I suppose we could use Dig. Yep, it's a good idea. And we need to get these guys a few levels to catch up with everyone else. Glare. That would have poisoned me, but luckily we're underground, and I missed. I meant paralyzed, not poison. <laughs> oh great, now I'm paralyzed, so the chance of hitting Dig is much lower. Luckily we got it off. I should probably take it out. Oh great, and they're probably gonna heal, or not. So as long as I don't get flinched or paralyzed, and that went very well. That was the best possible scenario. Level 29, nice. Wheezing. Right. I I suppose we could go with Pikachu because we, we better use Pikachu against Team Rocket. Uh, Thunderbolt. Go for it. Wow, that did a lot. Thanks to that crit. And another Thunderbolt should be the end of this wheezing. Yep. A thousand experience. Nice. I feel like I've been not using Pikachu, but it's still really high leveled. You'll regret this. Looks like Team Rocket's blasting off again. Yeah, I think I think it was good we used Pikachu there. 
And we'll see Mr. Fuji. Heh, <laughs> you came to save me? Thank you, but I came here of my own free will. I came to calm the soul of Cubone's mother. I think Marowak's spirit has gone to the afterlife. I must thank you for your kind concern. Follow me to my home, Pokemon House, at the foot of this tower. Here we are, we're back in Lavender Town. And Mr. Fuji wants us to talk to him, so let's do that. Daniel, your Pokedex quest may fail without love for your Pokemon. I think this may help your quest. You must make room for this. Oh, I don't have any room in my inventory. <laughs> let's throw something out. Um, what's the worst thing we have? Let's get rid of the lemonade. Okay, now we can take the item he wants to give us. Pokedex question. Yeah, yeah, you told us. You gave us a Poke Flute. That'll be helpful for the next time. Lavender Town music is going nuts. Anyway, that's a great place to end this episode. So thank you all for watching, and be sure to stop in next time. Goodbye.